Hey, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is a different video I'm doing today. I'm doing the best gig work channels to watch to make more money. So if you are a gig worker or you're a beginning gig worker and you are having a hard time making money, I highly recommend that you watch this video full because I have a lot of channels for you guys to help you make more money. That gives you a bunch of tips and tricks in order to do that. Disclaimer, I am not a gig worker at the moment. I am waiting to get my car. So I am doing research watching these different channels so I can have everything down packed when it is my turn to get out there. But I do know people that do gig work, especially Instacart, Grubhub, DoorDash, etc. And I do, if I find a new tip to help them make more money, I let them know and the tips do work. So we definitely, I definitely implemented these tips in real life and they did show results for sure. So I'm gonna talk about eight different channels and these are the best channels in my opinion. I know they have plenty of them, but these are just the ones that I mainly watch. And I do watch these videos constantly. Like I'm subscribed to most of the channels and I always watch them. Some I watch more than others, but I've watched enough videos back to back to back. I binge watch these channels. So trust me, I know what I'm talking about. I've been with them from the ground up. So I definitely know that there are good channels to let you know how to make money, how to make more money and, you know, just increase your earnings. I know a lot of people are not working nine to five. I am currently not working nine to five. I am a full-time YouTuber at the moment. And I also have a different, another side hustle that I'm doing that is not gig work, but it's a side. I'm gonna get straight into the video. This is not for my subscribers. This is for anybody who wants to do gig work or learn more about it. So make sure you guys um, like and subscribe to this channel. Like this video, subscribe to this channel, as well as subscribe to these channels if you do like their content that they're putting out. I highly recommend them and I highly recommend you subscribe so you guys can really get the full on information that they have to share with you. First one I have for you and all the information will be on the screen, their sub count, the amount of videos that they have. I'm gonna play some of the videos throughout. No sound, obviously, but you're gonna see how they are, personality, kindest, sort of. First one's gonna be Tat Var. I don't know how I stumbled upon his videos, but I've watched his videos back to back to back. He even took a break and his subscribers, including me, missed his videos. So he is back right now and on, exclusively does Instacart, but he just started doing DoorDash. Instacart is his main thing. He is working to fund his business, which is a super smart, idea great content super knowledgeable editing and music in the video is always on point and he has a very positive attitude and he really goes hard with instacart so he gets up at about 6 a.m i believe or or he leaves the house 6 a.m and he does instacart till it gets dark outside his main stores are like wegman costco he does the costco drop he has a bunch of people also working in his inner circle because I think he does like real estate stuff. So he's just, like I said, using the Instacart money, the DoorDash money to fund his actual business. So that's a really smart thing to do. So if you guys are looking to start your own business, Instacart, DoorDash, any of the gigs would be a great way for you to get started and to make money because all that is instant money right now. So you have a car, you sign up, pass the background checks and everything like that. You're out there driving, but you have to put in the work. You just can't say, oh, well, I only worked um, two days and only made whatever, $50, $100. That's because you're doing something wrong. That's why I made these videos in order to motivate you guys in order to get more money from the gig work. Because I always feel like everything is mainly consistency because you'll see in most of these videos, everybody is consistent at what they're doing. That's why they're getting their results. Anyway, that's his main thing. Instacart, he tells you how to, he also has a course, I believe, on different things with Instacart, but I just like his videos. His energy is really good, really positive. He's very go, 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 go all the time. As I said, definitely check out Tat Var. Um, I'll put all of his things on the screen so you guys can go subscribe to him, but I can't, I'm not good at explaining, so you guys have to definitely go Next watch. one is Pedro DoorDash Santiago. So he is a multi-apper. I do not believe he does Instacart at all. He only does Uber, DoorDash, obviously. So I think he does Uber Eats, DoorDash, and he also does Uber People. Well, Uber Driver, whatever you want to call it. So I've been watching his channel for a while, like almost from the very beginning. And now he's almost at like 20,000 subscribers. So he really blew up. He had consistent videos every single day. And he also is consistent in his work. He, If one app is not popping off, he goes to the next app. So multi-apping is a big thing for him as well. So I put for his bullet point, multiple apps, Uber, DoorDash, high energy, keeps the vlogs interesting, gives great tips, built his channel from the ground up and is very successful. And a mini sub, be with consistency. So that's like I said, consistency is the key. I would say if you guys are not making the money that you want, I would say pick a week 
that you have go out there wake up early that's the main thing i know they had the new instacart update that was messing up everybody like no batches anywhere etc so wake up as early as possible and grind throughout that day and see if it makes a difference for the whole week see if you make more money just try it out don't knock it till you try it you never know it could just be you're not working at your full potential and these people will definitely keep you motivated you'll see the numbers that they're doing how they're doing it etc definitely check out pedro doordash santiago i believe he has like a call and show at the night time where he takes live calls does that quite often so definitely check him this one is young kk I've been watching her since she was at about 4,000 subs. She's now at 8,000 subs. Her channel grew like almost overnight. She did Vlogmas and then she kept on vlogging. So she said her goal is to vlog for 500 days like um, Jake Paul, I believe. So she vlogs every single day, does Instacart every single day, along with a little bit of DoorDash as well. So that's hard work to vlog and edit and get the videos out every day. That's really hard work. She's definitely a good one to watch very entertaining uh very positive very upbeat she always makes a goal for herself let's just say the order will take 40 minutes she'll say she's gonna do it in 30 so i'm gonna put her channel right there so you guys can see everything so she's actually working to fund her future businesses she bought land from the instacart money that she made during the pandemic and she plans on building a house there i believe to rent out or airbnb so her vlog she vlogs her instacart journey throughout the day sticks to her format very motivational so her videos are the same every single day she says the same thing so she has a very good consistency throughout her videos you know what to expect you know the format it's just like a routine type of thing and i like that type of video to watch very good format to have basically so she's really good she'll definitely give you some inspiration throughout the day you'll see how hard she worked the number she's hitting I believe most of her goals is like $1,800 a week and she reaches most of them. So if you want to make the money she makes, she's in a California um, area doing this. So that might help out a little bit, but still her vlogs are really, really good. Number four is Rookie Riches. I stumbled upon this channel because I was trying to learn about Spark Driver. He does Spark Driver, which for Walmart, I think he did a little bit of roadie before. Go Puff as well. So that's the three main things that he does. So I do watch some of his GoPuff videos and I watch a lot of his Spark videos. So Spark basically is the easiest one because he does a lot of curbside. You just go there, they put the stuff in your car and you deliver it. So you'll have sometimes multiple deliveries, sometimes just one and it's good money, definitely. I believe somebody made $114,000 in a year on Spark, a lady. So they have a video about that on YouTube. So look that up if you wanna check that out. But Spark is a really good one. Spark is not at all the area is really good. He's very motivational. He does multi-apping, has a lot of drive, very positive, and knows what he's talking about. So he explains everything about the app, what he did previously to what's going on with the app now. It's good if it's not good, etc. He also does um, eBay selling as well as doing the multi-apping during the day, the night. So yeah, if you guys want to learn about GoPuff, Spark, I don't know if he does roadie anymore, but yeah, GoPuff and Spark, definitely go check that out. Ricky Riches, a new YouTuber. He's under a thousand subs right now. His name is, I don't know how to say his name, but it's Apid or Apid Cart. I think it's Apid Cart. So he's a new YouTuber, very frequent, keeps us up to date on the latest app updates. Very informative channel. Definitely will go far in the YouTube game if he keeps up his consistency. So he has a lot to say. I seen a video recently, I think I put it up here. It was a thousand pound um, Instacart order. So he does definitely do good tips and tricks to keep date on any Instacart updates, anything you guys may need to know about Instacart. And he just, you know, let you guys know. For him to be a small channel, when I look at his thumbnails, I had no idea that he was under a thousand. So he's putting in work from the ground up. So he's definitely gonna go far. His channel is gonna blow. I already know, I already see it. He has the drive, the motivation. So yeah, definitely one to watch. Definitely check out his channel. Help him get to his thousand subs because he deserves it. The amount of editing, the video quality as well is really good. So, and the thumbnails is, is there. Next one is Megan Reisman. She is mainly like, DoorDash, etc. I'll put that up there if I don't really know because I only watched her video 
I watched her channel maybe like, I don't know. I watched her videos a couple times. I like the way that she filmed on like a head mounted camera. So it's like you're there picking up the order. So I just like that. She's super energetic. She does challenges here and there. At times her customers try to scam her. I'm not exactly sure why. I'm not sure if it's cause she's so bubbly and then they could just get over on her, but mm -mm, stop doing that to Megan. But yeah, she's energetic, films on a head mounted camera. Like I said, does a lot of challenges and she's a go getter. Like she is posting consistently constantly so you'll always see a video from her her nails are very attention grabbing so definitely check out megan reisman for she doesn't do instacart content but she does a lot of doordash i believe she does uber eats so she multi apps as well throughout the video um next one is gonna be carmise she i watched the video a few times she is from where i'm previously from which is new york so I love her energy and her drive. She thinks outside the box, takes us in the locations with her and has great filming skills. And she's also very consistent with her videos. Um, she does a lot of food related things, not Instacart, but she does like Uber, DoorDash, etc. I think she does more DoorDash than anything, but Carmise is definitely a one to watch. She lets you know everything that's going on, tells us what the customer is saying to her, tells us how much she's gonna make out Carmise. And then last but not least is hustling and driving. So his channel, he's in the Philadelphia area. He's very motivated, tells it like it is, help you to understand multiple different apps and also the best way to make money on them. Also, she has his own experience and he's also a former business owner. So I watched a couple of his videos and he did say that he used to own a barbershop and I'm actually a licensed cosmetologist. So that's a big deal when you actually own your own hair salon or your own barbershop because you just don't want to work for nobody. You work so hard to get where you're at, to learn your skills and you just want to be free. So I'm not sure why he doesn't have the barbershop anymore. He didn't go into detail, but he does tell you guys about Rody and I believe he does. Yeah, he mainly talked about Rody, but he definitely tells you, you know, if you're not finding nothing in your city at the moment, go outside your city, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, etc. Don't just be stuck to your one little area and wonder why you're not making money. You have to go out to these different stores and see what you can find. I would highly recommend that you guys go into the wealthier areas to get better tips and stuff like that. I said, I'm not a gig worker as of yet, but I'm learning all these tips and I would definitely drive outside of my area in order to see and test what's better for me because I'm trying to get the maximum amount of money for my time. And you should be too. So those are the channels that I suggest you watch. And if you guys are looking to make more money and wondering why your money is not as high as high earning channels or whatever, definitely check them out they will teach you some things for sure learn so much things from these channels like you will be so surprised of what i know and not actually physically doing the gig work and stuff so like i said if you want daily content check out young kk tatvar is almost on the daily content type of thing pedro doordash santiago p cart riches he's not daily but he's very frequent as well and megan reisman is also frequent carmise She's, you know, back and forth, but she does have a lot of videos. And then Hustling and Driving also has quite a few videos. Let me know down below if you guys watch any of these content creators. Let me know um, when you do implement their tips, if it worked for you to make more money. I do also have a bunch of different side hustling videos on my channel. If you guys want to check that out, if you are not doing gig work or anything like that, I have ways to make money from selling your clothes, ways to make money from selling wigs. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down below what you think about these um, gig workers and if you watch any of them. And let me know other channels that you may watch of gig work that'll definitely help to give me some more tips and definitely help my subscribers as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time.